always a rainbow within reach on animal so good to see you. You're just in time. I was about to check the mail. I'm expecting a letter from Ms. Panda. Let's check the mail together. Are you coming? Look, there's a letter in our mailbox. It's addressed to Mr. Goose, the Treehouse, Animal Island. That means it's for me. Could it be from Ms. Panda? It is from Ms. Panda. I'll open it. There is a letter and some pictures inside. I'll read the letter out loud. Hello, everyone. I'm visiting my friend. Everywhere I go, I see shapes. I've sent you some photos. Ooh, let's look. What shape do you see in the first picture? Hmm. Do you see it? Circle. Well done. What shape do you see in the second picture? Oh, I think I see it. Circle. Fantastic. What shape do you see in the last picture? Hmm. What shape do you see? Circle. Yes. Can you find shapes on Animal Island? Love, Ms. Panda. That's a great idea. We'll make Circle our special shape of the day. Let's look for circles on Animal Island. Let's look for circles. Do you see one? Let's look for another one. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! Hi, Ms. Panda. What are you doing? Hi, Monkey. I cut out all of these colored shapes, and now I'm sorting them. Can I help? I would love it if you helped. Thank you, Monkey. First, find all the blue squares and put them in a box. Okay. Hmm. There's one. There's another one. This is blue? It is, but that's a circle. We only want blue squares. Oh, right. I forgot. 
Here's a blue square. Thank you, monkey. Now let's gather all of the red squares. Okay! Here. Here. Here's one. Here. Oh, and here. Splendid. Should I look for yellow squares now, Miss Panda? That's a good idea. Okay. Here. And here. Great. And what's left? Two circles. Okay. Let's put both of them in their own box. Okie dokie. We've sorted all the shapes. Thank you so much, monkey. What are all of these shapes for? Whatever we want. We can use them to make art projects. Ooh, I could use the two circles to make a mask. Look. <laughs> <laughs> you certainly could, monkey. I knew those circles would come in handy. <laughs> It's story time! Yay! Gather round, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Achu. How loud is an elephant's sneeze? Let's read and find out. Let's begin. Achu. Written by Deepa Balsavar, illustrated by Nancy Raj. Achoo! went Monkey. She had a terrible cold. That was loud. I almost fell off the tree, said Cuckoo, poking his head through the leaves. Really? asked Monkey. If this is loud, how loud do you think an elephant sneeze would be? I can only guess, said Cuckoo. Maybe as loud as this. Ah-choo! That's not loud enough, said Porcupine. An elephant's sneeze is much louder than that. Ah-choo! He blew out his little cheeks and his pointy nose quivered. Grunt, grunt, said Wild Boar. That's not loud enough. An elephant's sneeze must be huge. And taking a deep breath, she went, uh, achoo! Grunt, grunt. What's all this noise? asked Deer. Do you know how loud an elephant sneeze is? asked Monkey. I always sneeze politely, said Deer with a sniff. But an elephant must have a huge, disgusting sneeze like this. Ah, 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 Excuse me. Ah, 
Poo! All the animals jumped, while Buffalo joined the group. That's an elephant's sneeze, he said proudly. Deer, wild boar, porcupine, cuckoo, and monkey looked at him with admiration. Not bad, but not quite, purred a low voice. Wild Buffalo's nose quivered. Tiger leaped out from behind the bushes. She threw her head back, opened her mouth wide, and gave the loudest sneeze you could ever imagine. She went, ah, ah, Elephant walked into the clearing. Pardon me, he said to Tiger. Do you have a cold too? I have one, and I am going to sneeze. What? roared Tiger. What? bellowed Wild Buffalo. What? barked Deer. What? grunted Wild Boar. What? squealed Porcupine. What? sang Cuckoo. Oh, wow, thought Monkey. Uh, well, uh, went Elephant. The whole forest waited. Here it comes, thought Monkey. Ah, that felt good, said Elephant. Nothing like a good sneeze to clear out the trunk. Then he looked around and wondered, Where have all the others gone? Cuckoo began to laugh. Now do you know how big an elephant sneeze is, he asked Monkey. Yes, said Monkey, but not another question, wailed Cuckoo and flew hurriedly away. The End Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids! It's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. I'm going to teach you a song called London Bridge. And look what I have in my backpack. A ukulele. I'll sing the song first. Then you sing along with me. OK, let's begin. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Now this time, we'll all sing together, OK? Okay! Yeah! Yes! I'm ready! Here we go! London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Well done! Thank you, Mr. Frog! Thank you for singing with me! Goodbye! Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Sax. Sax ends with X. Sax. X ray. X ray begins with X. X ray. Ends with X. X. Fox. Fox ends with X. Fox. Hello. <laughs> Box. Box ends with X. Box. <laughs> Ah. 
That's right. The letter X. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Goose, can we trace a letter? Absolutely. Let's practice making the letter X. Who can think of a fun way to do it? Ooh, ooh, I know. Let's trace letters on the dirt using the watering can. Well, that sounds like a great idea. Pig, why don't you go first? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. X. Great. Try next. <laughs> X. Ah. Terrific tracing. Now let's trace the lowercase letter. I want to try. <laughs> Nice job! My turn! <laughs> X! <laughs> you did it! Let's look at the letters we made. What's this letter? X! Exactly! Uppercase X! And what's this letter? X! That's right! Lowercase x! Nice job! Wow! Wow! Cool! Nice work, everybody! Thank you, Mr. Goose! It's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Pussy cat, pussy cat, where have I've been to London to look at the Queen. Pussy cat, pussy cat, what did you there? I frightened a little mouse under the chair.